five. Ready? One. A two. A three. Grab a lawyer your own on a bed to bed to bed to trip on a bed to bed to bed to trip on a bed to bed to bed to trip. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Q. Thank you for joining the channel. Thank you for clicking the video. Glad you could be here today with me. If this is your first time here, make sure you hit the thumbs up. Actually, smash that thumbs up button. Make sure you subscribe and hit the bell for new content coming your way. Um, today, I wanted to do a quick video about, um, I got some new stuff for the channel. When I say new stuff, just some new equipment. And one really not new equipment. Well, it is, but it's not. You'll see here in a second. Uh, but I'm actually pretty tired. I'm making this video. It's pretty late. Uh, we actually just got back from Houston. Brielle and I went to Houston this weekend um, to see one of her good friends. Um, so we, you know, I've been going out of town all weekend. It was a sad day. My faithful, sturdy, reliable Note 4 actually cracked it. I cracked it. To give you a perspective, the phone I had was a Note 4. They're now on the Note 9. It's set to release like later this month. So. Um, I was rocking the Note 4 for a long time. You know, I like my Note 4 for one. Number two, I just finished paying for it. So as soon as I finished paying for it, I break it, you know. And so, you know, I was kind of enjoying my note payments on my cell phone. And so I was trying to hold out as uh, long as I could before purchasing a new phone. Um, and yeah, I cracked it. Now, how I cracked it, <laughs> I actually stepped on it. And when I, <laughs> yeah, so... And the funny part about that is I have dropped this phone down three or four flights of stairs. Anywhere, any way you can imagine, I have dropped this phone. So the case actually was pretty good, but dropped this phone and not once did it crack. I mean, it never cracked. Um, and it, on, all it took was me to step on it. So like I said, I guess that means probably need to lose some weight for one but um uh, and it probably was time anyway just get a new phone so one point it got so hot when i was trying to do videos actually it got so hot that it froze so i had to go put it in the fridge for it to cool down so you know when, it, when it's getting hot you got to put it in the fridge cool down it's probably time to get a new phone i've been samsung and android ever since i had a cell phone it's been android and samsung so i had an iphone for a short period of time went right back to the android and samsung because I just didn't care for the iPhone that much. So, I do got a new phone. Comment below and tell me what you think it is before I reveal it here. Let me flip you around real quick. Show y'all what the Note 4 looks like cracked. And um, also going to reveal the new phone to you all and why I got it. Hey, I got a new subscriber. Y'all saw that in there? But anyway, uh, so as you see, it's cracked pretty bad um, here. And actually, the only reason I finally decided to get rid of, rid of it is because somewhere right here the screen isn't working anymore. Somewhere in here, of course it's gonna work now, but screen is working anymore. You can tell this crack, cracked pretty good. The Note 4 has come to an end. RIP to the Note 4. But I did get a new phone. So, are y'all ready for the new phone? Ready? One, a two. A three. <laughs> Boom. Yep, that's right. I crossed over. So I actually crossed over and got the iPhone X or 10. Uh, hard choice in, in, you know, especially like I said, being Android and Samsung for so long. The phone's not in here. I've already been using it. I just haven't been able to post this video, record this video. So here's the actual phone here. Like I said, I've already been using it. Main reason for getting this iPhone 10, um, mainly was because, honestly, I'm gonna be 100% honest with you, it was because I've been using iMovie Maker to edit and make all my videos. So what I have, what I've been doing prior to the last video you saw, I've been, uh, I shoot on my Note 4, Dropbox it, uh, to Dropbox, <laughs> Brielle is on a crutch right now. I will show you all, but she sprained her ankle Friday at the gym. We was working out, but y'all want to say hey to a crutch? Show your crutch, babe. Just stick it up. 
That's her crutch. So she sprained her ankle uh, Friday. So she's on crutches right now at the moment. But she's okay. She's getting better. Uh, so she'll probably be back to 100 here pretty soon. So what I would do, record on my Note 4. And after recording on my Note 4, I would Dropbox everything. And then I would log on to Brielle's iPad from the Dropbox, export all the videos to her iPad, and then I will use her iPad to make the movies, which was very time consuming for the most part. Um, and it just took a while to export the videos. And then my phone here, not here, sorry, the note would get hot and then it would like, I couldn't use it. So it kind of got kind of got frustrating to be going back and forth, back and forth with that. So um, that was really the, honestly, the main thing <laughs> that made me get the iPhone was just basically provide more content to you all uh, faster, just from sheer size alone. I mean, I think this phone fits inside yeah, it does. It is some, my, my iPhone 10 now fits inside the Note 4. And I'll be honest with you, I did get bugs sometimes with this phone uh, in my pocket because it's so big. I mean, it's huge as opposed to this. It's super small. It's much lighter. Um, so I do like that part about it. But as far as the process and everything, I mean, I, I'm not going to even compare the two. Of course, this is a new phone, iPhone 10, the latest phone. This is a Note 4. And it came out four or five years ago. So uh, not that type of video. But as you can see, Jordan Summerville, for my little brother, just replied to a comment on my video. But anyway, um, yeah, so I mean, this I do like it. I thought the transition from Apple to Android would be a big one. But actually, the, I find this iPhone very easy to use. I'm going to be completely honest with you. It's, it's not, you know, I, I really thought it was going to be a huge transition, but it's, it's really not at all. Um, I'm actually shocked as how how quick I have adapted to using the iPhone. I also got another thing for you all that's gonna help with my channel as well. And it's right over here to my right. And so it's for openness. Take a guess as to what you think it is that's in this box. But I'm gonna go ahead and open it now. And here it is. That's right, I got this Smooth 4. So, not sure I pronounce this, this is Zyam, Zyam. So it's a Smooth 4, so basically, um, I've been watching my videos as I've been recording them, and I do watch my videos and I go back and kind of critique myself on what I've been doing in my videos. And uh, for one, holding the camera handheld, as you can see here, it's kind of blue, blue, shaky, shaky. So basically, this is just gonna give me a smoother uh, look on my videos, transition. And having an iPhone 10 as well hopefully you know by combining these two together um it'll just come out with some better content also when i was doing this reading about this smooth four um it wasn't it was more compatible with the iphone than it was with the uh samsung galaxy s9 which was the other option i was looking into so apparently uh, there was some issue with the app that they really didn't support Android type software, but apparently they updated that. But that was my main reason for getting the iPhone 10 as well, just because of the, uh, this is very compatible with it. I just wanna give y'all a quick update. I haven't posted any truck videos here lately, and mainly because those, the last two videos y'all probably saw, which was me, uh, me and Brielle's date night, and um, the cooking, I actually had those recorded those videos for a while and I just hadn't had the time to edit them because they both were like, one was 36 minutes long, the other one was 46. So I had to go and edit those videos, as you may know if you do YouTube videos. I had to go and edit those to get them down to a uh, decent amount of time. So it just took a long time to get those edited. But I got them edited. I was also running out of space because on my Dropbox here, I was running out of space trying to have all those videos uploaded, added to Dropbox, and then her iPad was running out of space. So it was just, it was just tough. So thank y'all for tuning in and watching again. Like, subscribe, hit the bell, and just like that, I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.